Hey, what's up? It's your boy, 24-7 here with 24-7 Fusion Media. And boy, this is some very interesting news. That Henry Winkler is going to be in the Black Adam movie. And I thought, wow, my boy the Fonz is going to be in the Black Adam movie. Black Adam has been a long time coming. Dwayne The Rock Johnson, who was portraying the title character, has been working on bringing this film to the big screen for over a decade, and it's almost here. Earlier this week, scooper Casey Welch of the GWW dropped a huge bomb when he revealed that Henry Winkler, known to most as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli from Happy Days, would be appearing in the film. We here at OTN also heard this but we've also learned who the legendary actor will be playing. Hmm. My boy, Henry Winkler. Boy, I love me some happy days, man. He was cool as fuck as the Fonz. Hated to see him jump the shark, though, but it is what it is. One Take News has learned that Henry Winkler will be playing the original Adam, Al Pratt. The Direct first reported that the character would appear in the film, but up until recently, it is unknown who'd be playing Al Pratt. Sources tell us he's only in the film in a short cameo when Noah Cantonio's Albert Rothstein, Adam Smasher, FaceTimes him to talk about his new job and the Adam Smasher suit. Our source specifically mentioned that Al Pratt has a line telling Rothstein not to destroy the suit. This scene has the same kind of banter as Hank Pym, Scott Lang scene, and it's almost tonally similar. Let's just get one thing straight. Al Pratt is the original Adam. Albert Rothstein became Adam Smasher. So even though he's taken the role of the Adam, it's kind of like on a whole nother level. So, you know, for them to be saying that Al Pratt is the original Adam Smasher, whoever wrote this shit got their facts all fucked up. Just to set the record straight, Al Pratt was the original Adam from the Just Society of America. Adam Smasher is a current member of the Just Society of America taking after his grandfather, the Adam, but they both have different powers. So I don't know what's going on here, if they're gonna sit there and make Henry Winkler Adam Smasher, but it doesn't make any sense when Al Pratt was just the Adam. So just to kind of give you guys a heads up on comic book history and letting you know I, I don't want to I don't want you guys to be deceived by what the article is telling you from what's actual fact you know that's all I'm saying that's where I'm coming from so it says here this cameo came out of left field for me and it sounds like it's a really fun role Winkler does a lot of roles like this and seeing him in the same movie as The Rock is really cool this cameo could be the start of a reoccurring role for Winkler in the DCU but only time will tell I hope so. Now, this is Adam Smasher. You know, he's he's more or less uh, like the Ant-Man. Like he could fucking he could grow to be as big as fuck. So that's not the power that Al Pratt had. Al Pratt was just strong as fuck. He had like a nuclear punch, you know, so he was he was something a little different. He was short like Wolverine, like he had like a, a hell of a of, of an energy to him. To where he was stronger than mostly everybody. So, uh, you know, it's two different things. Albert Rothstein took the name of Adam Smasher to basically pay homage to his grandfather. But he added the Smasher part, so he kind of made it his own thing. But Al Pratt is the original Adam. So, I, I hate when they fucking do that. You know, now they're making it to where it's like they're changing it in the movie when they don't, when they don't have to. I don't know, man. Fuck all that. You can catch Henry Winkler along with the rest of Black Adam's stacked cast when it hits theaters on July 29th, 2020. All right. Well, there goes to show that there's a lot of things that this movie's taking and kind of twisting it to make it his own instead of just, you know, just instead of just letting the history speak for itself. Why you got to change so much shit? So... This movie, man, I don't know, man. This is just something that we're going to have to see. But some things are looking cool. Other things are looking whack as fuck. 
I don't know what to really make of this. I'm just glad to see that Henry Winkler's in there as the Adam, not the Adam Smasher. But who knows, man? Hopefully this fucking movie's not a dud, but the fact that The Rock's in it is going to make some money. So that's my take on it. That's how I feel about this. I'm glad to see Henry Winkler is in the movie, at least. Hopefully they portray, you know, he's portrayed you know, in a good way. So hopefully he'll be uh, recurring and coming back for the for the next installments of Black Adam. But that's my take and that's how I feel about it. You guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. Please share, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. It's your boy, 24-7 here with 24-7 Fusion Media. And I'm out. Peace.